I hired a company to come in and remodel my master closet at my primary residence. During that process, I found out that I was going to have to find someone to tear out the demo, redo all the electrical, add in uh, a new um, attic stairs, uh, all the things. And they walked out and said, you're gonna have a beautiful closet, but you gotta have all this stuff done by the time we come back. So when I found out that I had to hire a handyman to come in and do all the demolition for the closet designers, I didn't know who to call. So I had a recommendation for Signature Home Services. It was a Saturday and I thought, oh, I'll just call them and they'll answer and or I'll get an answering machine and I'll just leave a message. I'll hear from them on Monday. It just so happens that I called Saturday and a young woman by the name of Robin answered the phone and she listened to my whole story and she was very sympathetic and said, I'll have Rob there Monday morning. What I didn't know is that I was talking to one of the co-owners. Robin and her husband, Rob, own Signature Home Services. And she answered the phone that day on a Saturday, listened to my dilemma, and then had her husband at my door at 9 a.m. on Monday. Amazing. Rob Matthew shows up Monday morning. I walk him through the closet. I tell him what all I have to have done. And he says, fine, no problem. I'll take care of it. And they did. And he worked hand in hand with my closet remodeler um, and filled in all the areas where they failed. For instance, they did not provide me a, a, a 3D model a rendering of the closet. I had no idea what the closet was going to look like. So Rob called them and got the plans and he uh, prepared a, a rendering for me so I could see what my new closet was gonna look like. And then we were off to the races. During the closet remodel, I had to go to Hawaii for two weeks for my son's wedding. I did not wanna hold up the project. So Rob babysat the project start to finish the whole entire two weeks while I was was out of the continental United States. So that was an, uh, a wonderful experience. So I come back, everything's finished, it's perfect, it's beautiful. Every detail was taken care of. So once I had such a wonderful experience with Signature Home Services, I said, you know, there's really phase two of my primary residence remodel that I wanted to complete. I had completed phase one prior but my husband recently passed away and I wanted to do phase two. So I said, can you do phase two? That's the beginning of another. I had such a wonderful experience uh, with my primary residence because there were add-ons after add-ons after add-ons because I was so happy with the results that I just kept adding projects. And then once I finally got my primary residence finished exactly the way I wanted it, I was also in the process of moving into my lake house that I spent almost three years designing, building, um, and got moved in. And then I had a major flood and I had to call someone to remodel my house. It was devastating because so, like I said, almost three years uh, of my life was spent building and designing this house. And I move in thinking I'm gonna enjoy it with my family and my friends and all my grandchildren. And, and then it's flooded. And I get the phone call. I get the dreaded phone call from my landscaper. Deborah, there's water pouring out of your front door. Oh, oh my gosh, it's pouring out of every door what do I do? And that was the beginning. And I had to decide immediately, what was I going to do? Because I, once I assessed the damage, it was, it was a major, major remodel. And having gone through 
over a year worth of projects with Signature Home Services at my pri at my primary residence, there was no doubt. No, I didn't even consider anybody else. It was going to be Signature to do the remodel for my lake house. Yes, and and that trust, I gained all I gained that trust with them over a year of projects. And and like I said earlier, I left for two weeks for my son's wedding and I was at a crucial point of the remodel of my master closet. And this was not just a master closet. This was a master closet that had a coffee bar and a wine bar and all the things. And I left it in Rob's hands and he took it. So yeah, I had total trust. There are no surprises. You are told up front. I was told up front. Here's what it's gonna cost. Here's where we're gonna get started. It's gonna take this long. And every detail regarding craftsmanship, um, the, the, all of the work is overseen and, and nothing flips by. Every detail is covered. I saw what they did with the master closet. So then I decided to give them something a little bigger. And that was phase two remodel. And then they completed the phase two remodel in the exact same fashion as they did with the master closet. And, and I'm talking about when their employees, when they were scheduled to be on the job, they would call me on the way to the job and say, hi, Ms. Mosley, we're on our way. We'll be there in 15 minutes. And they would show up and then they would put booties on their shoes and then they would cover the walkways. I mean, every detail was covered. They were very particular about maintaining my home. They did not want to mess anything up and they cleaned everything up on their way out. I had never experienced that before. And I'm not here to say that my remodel went perfect. I'm here to say that every time an issue came up, it was addressed and handled professionally and timely. And that's all any customer really wants. That They're not expecting perfect. They just want someone to handle the problem. And from the person that answers the phone all the way to the owners, it's handled. When, for me personally, when they walked into my primary residence and then now my lake house, they treated it as if it was their own house. No, de no, no detail was too small. If it, if it wasn't exactly the way it was supposed to be, they made it right. And so you felt like they took, I felt like they took pride in their work. And uh, craftsmanship is important. No project is too small, which I found out. Master closet, and no project is too big, and in a complete lake house legacy home remodel. I have been from the small end all the way to the large end and everything in between. Yeah, did you know that when you do an epoxy floor in your garage, that you can get glitter? Rob knew how much I loved glitter. And he made sure that there was glitter on my garage floor. Now who does that? Rob. <laughs> well, thank you so much, Deborah. You're welcome. <laughs>